Sepak Takro is a century old Asian sport. It's described as volleyball with your feet, but then on the badminton field. It's huge in Asia, but for us quite unknown. Yeah, and with us we have uh, Roshan, who is here to tell us all about this sport and why it's gaining popularity. And he's kind of a local celebrity in Malaysia because he's the host of a sport channel called Astro Super Sports. Yes, welcome. Can you explain us how we have to play it? Well, it's very simple. I think you describe it the best. It's basically volleyball, but with your feet. So in each team, you're allowed three exponents on the pitch or on the court at one given time. Two are standing beside the net and there's one that is as I would put it, as a defensive holding midfielder, if I can explain it in terms of football. And now uh, what it is, is basically each team is allowed three touches. You can touch the ball, the rattan ball, with your, either your feet, your chest, or your head. Under no circumstances can you handle the ball, and you must get the ball into your opposition court within those three touches. Now, if you want to know how these guys do it, take a footballer and take a ninja, and that is what you get an exponent of Sepak Takro. They are unbelievable. They will almost be inverted, literally head down with their feet to smash the ball. It's called a spike and that's how you win. And as, um, as a Malaysian, I have to say, Thailand right now are the team that is unstoppable right now. Absolutely amazing. Nice, nice. So is this a traditional sport for people in Malaysia? What are the origins of this sport? Well, I'm proud to say that the origins are from Malaysia. It was actually dated back to the 15th century in a state called Malacca here, which happens to be my mom's hometown, so yay. Uh, and as time progressed, it is uh, spread to Thailand, to Indonesia, and as far east as the Philippines. And it's, it's a game uh, rich with tradition. And like I said, we started off as the powerhouse, but it's moved on to Thailand and it's making a comeback here on the local scene as well. It kind of disappeared from the urban market. So what's happening right now is that the TV stations, the one that I work for as well, are heavily backing this sport and it's uh, become a domestic league of sorts. And it's going around the region and it's really making a comeback, which I feel very happy about because it, it is a sport that was invented in Malaysia. Okay, thank you so much. We're very excited no to see them at the Olympics. Ha <laughs>